Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Fast Food Fiasco Friday. Ah. Um, so yeah, so like I said before, we're having a day totally devoted to fast food today, me and my wife, because we can and we deserve it, so whatever. So here is breakfast. I just want to show you guys this, because this is ridiculous. Uh-huh. Yep. This is Taco Bell Waffle Taco, AM Crunchwrap, McGriddle, Hash Brown. McDonald's and Taco Bell on the same meal. Holy cow! Like I can't even tell you. Like I'll, I'll get into the macros and stuff in a little bit, but I'm gonna document this entire day, and it's going to be amazing. All right, so I'm gonna dig into this because I've been looking at it for like the past 10 minutes. Um, so yeah, so breakfast is on. Whew. All right, guys. So I just finished my breakfast. There's the orange juice cup. There's that plate again. The empty box from the taco. That was, that was all really, really good. Um, so let me tell you kind of where I'm at as far as calories and stuff go. I've got it plugged into my fitness pal. <clears throat> so I have eaten, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, 1,982 calories. Um, let's see what my macros are so far. I'll put all this information, we'll put it right here. We'll put all the information here on the screen so you can see this. Um, I've had 98 grams of fat. I've had 204 grams of carbs and 64 grams of protein. So I'm on it now, right in this second, I'm about to have this cup of whole milk and this delightful snack right here, a banana cream Twinkie. Um, and I've, hey Carson, what's up buddy? And so uh, I, I'm seeing on YouTube a bunch of like 10,000 calorie challenges. I'm not gonna probably hit 10,000 calories, but I'm just gonna see how many I can hit. Why not, right? All right, cool, so I'm gonna slam into this here. I'm gonna I haven't had whole milk in probably a year. Oh man. Oh, it's so good. Okay, so let me uh, dive into this Twinkie and uh, milk and then I'll come back and uh, I'll see you then. Oh, this is so good. I just wanted to prove to everybody. Here's a fun fact about Twinkies I didn't know. Did you know that on the on the packaging, a serving size is two Twinkies? Even though they're individually wrapped? No. Calories. Cool. <laughs> Eating again. So we're having two waffles, chocolate chip waffles, covered in Nutella. What? Four hundred calories. And everything. Mm. And it's lunch time. This is lunch. A lot of checkers on this plate. A sub. A hamburger, fries. This is like 2,000 calories just in this one meal. Oh yeah, and a Coke the size of my head. <laughs> yeah, so 2,000 calories, lunch. I'm only not even, I'm not even halfway to 10,000. I don't know if I'll ever be able to get 10,000 calories. I'm not even halfway there. But I'm gonna dig into this because it looks delicious. And I've been looking at it for a few minutes, so. Time to eat. All right, guys, so I just finished lunch. Oh, that was a lot. Um, that lunch was exactly 2,058 calories for the two sandwiches and the fries and the Coke. And the Coke I'm still kind of working on. It's my first real Coke the entire year. It's okay, kind of watered down. Checkers doesn't have the best Cokes, but it's what it is. So for the entire day, I am at a total of 4,875 calories. Oh, this side. Right here. 4,875. And here, I'm going to give you kind of an update on my uh, my macros, my fats, and my carbs, and my um, proteins. So I have had 235 grams of fat. I have had... 
548 grams of carbs. Jeez. And I have had 149 grams of protein. I, I actually, it, what's funny is I haven't hit my protein goal for the day. So you can kind of see why people who eat this crap um, on a daily basis, why they're so fat. Because, I mean, it's all fat in carbs. It's all you're putting in your system. Um, uh, sugars, I've had 261 grams of sugars. Uh, yeah, 21 grams of fiber, which isn't bad. Yeah, uh, sodium. Oh, here we go. Sodium. 7,302 grams of sodium so far. Um, yeah, so you can kind of see this is not the healthiest, but hey, it's one day. I am feeling pretty full right now. Um, fuller than I have after, after breakfast. Uh, so we'll see what happens. I've got uh, Hungry Howie's Pizza later. I've got a Oreo Blizzard later. Maybe something in the middle between there because it's only it's 3 o'clock. So uh, I'm about halfway there at 3 o'clock. Not even halfway yet, though. And it's 3 o'clock. So we'll see what happens. But uh, yeah, so I will uh, keep going. Uh, guys, what's up? Um, it is 3.52, uh, about an hour after I ate my Checkers Mania. And I'm having now a Shakeology. Yep, I'm still having Shakeology today. However, I've never done this before, but I'm having it with whole milk. It's delicious with whole milk. Um, so I made about a 600 calorie uh, shake, whole milk, banana, some protein powder. I also wanted to get some protein in my system because I haven't really had much today. Um, so this kind of balances out my protein. <laughs> Not really, but gives me some protein along with the craziness that I've had today. It's also giving me my um, couple uh, servings of fruits and veggies that I need um, just, to, just to get my body something healthy, healthy kick. Um, still made it 600 calories, which uh, grand total with this shake gives me a total of 5,480 calories. So over halfway there, it's four o'clock almost. Um, I still have a full Hungry Howie's pizza, have a blizzard to eat later. So we'll see what happens. Maybe I get 10,000, maybe I don't. But let me show you, it's so, so good. Mm. Oh, so good. All right guys, see you a little bit later. All right, I gotta get my microphone close to me. So I just finished my shake a little bit ago. And I am dying right now. Oh, I'm so full. Like, I could probably, probably could throw up. And <clears throat> so, it's 4.09. We'll see what happens the rest of the day. Because right now, I am hurting. Like, I think the first bathroom trip is going to be happening pretty shortly. <sighs> like, you ever eat, like, Thanksgiving dinner? And then when you're done, you're so full, you can't move. It's about where I'm at right now. So, yeah, that's my update. I will be back later, and we'll see what happens later. All right, guys, I had to take my shirt off. That's how serious I'm getting. I'm like, I feel better than I did a little bit ago. It was, oh, I was hurting after lunch. But it is now time for dinner, I guess you call this. First of all, I don't have it because I ate it too fast, but I made myself a Nutella mug cake in a little mug it was like 630 calories and it was 630 calories of deliciousness and now it's time for dinner first of all to drink i've got this big glass of mountain dew which i haven't had one of those in forever and what do i have here hungry howie's pizza hold on holy cow oh man i don't know we got pizza i don't know how much of this i'm gonna have but so I can't really tell you what how many calories I'm gonna have yet. But when I'm done eating this, I'll let you know how many calories I've had so far. Because right now I'm at like just over 6,000 calories with that mug cake. So time to dig into this bad boy, and I'll let you know what's up. Ugh. Yeah, all right. So whew, just ate half half the pizza. That was all I could do. And plus, I want a blizzard later on, so. I'm not gonna overstuff myself. I want the rest of the pizza. I may eat it later, but I'm not gonna eat it the rest of it right now. That pizza that I just ate was a total of 1,620 calories on its own. Plus, I had uh, some Mountain Dew, which is about 230 calories. So, and then the mug cake I had before was 600. So, grand total for the day so far, I am at 7,939 calories. 
10,000 is looking like a long shot, but we'll see. If I eat, if I get the nerve up to eat the rest of that pizza later on and have a blizzard, maybe someone out and do it, maybe we can do it. But right now, I'm, I'm pretty pretty full. Um, uh, yeah, stomach hurts a little bit. Yeah, it hurt a lot earlier. I didn't want to eat anything else ever again. But now I'm like, whatever. But we'll see what happens. Maybe I can get 10,000. If not, I'll get as close as I possibly can. But anyways, um, cool. So we're going to go get a blizzard here in a little bit. Um, and we'll talk to you when we go and do that. And I'll let you know kind of where we're at. Calorie wise, after I eat it. Cool. Woo! Hey, what's going on? So we're in the car, singing some Frozen. What's up, guys? Woo! Woo! So we're also enjoying some Dairy Queen. I have a medium Oreo cheesecake blizzard with some vanilla ice cream, which is going to be delicious. Oh man, I can't wait to eat this thing. Um, so yeah, made a trip out Dairy Queen, having fun with the family. A little Frozen going on. Let it go, let it go. Okay, so I'm gonna eat this. I'm tired of just sitting here looking at it and holding it. So I'm gonna eat it, and uh, yeah, I'll see you when I get back home. Later. Well, so just got home from Dairy Queen, had a medium Oreo cheesecake blizzard, which was 820 calories in that blizzard, uh, which gives my grand total for the day at this point at 8,759 calories. I don't know if any more calories are going to happen. <laughs> that may be the end of it. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give you kind of the wrap up of my macros for the day because I don't think I'm going to eat anything else. My stomach just can't handle it. I'm, I'm hurting. I think it's the dairy. I don't eat, I don't drink much dairy um, regularly. So the fact that I've had like two big glasses of whole milk and a huge ice cream blizzard is really really bothering me so I don't I'm probably gonna eat anymore but anyways um so yeah almost 9,000 calories I was I mean for never ever ever doing this I think that's pretty good and for eating no more than like 3,000 a day for the past year most of the time about 2,000 to 2,500 a day that's a big jump um all right so here we go totals for the day total fat I had 396 uh, grams of fat uh, that's a lot. Uh, let's see. Uh, carbs. Carbs. I had 990 grams of carbs. Yeah, that's a lot of carbs for the day. Um, let's see. Protein. 301 proteins, which is crazy. But that's a little protein that you have when you eat that stuff. 301 proteins. 476 grams of sugar. Uh, 40 grams of fiber, which is over everything. Sodium. You ready for this number? <clears throat> sodium, my goal is usually about 2,300 uh, grams of sodium, or milligrams of sodium a day. Uh, I ate 11,366 grams of milligrams of sodium today. Um, that is like 9,000 over my uh, my goal for usual. So yeah, um, my polysaturated fats, the saturated fats, every, trans fats, everything was over. Cholesterol was over. Uh, my goal for cholesterol was 300. I did 1,196 milligrams of cholesterol. Um, yeah. So needless to say, that's a pretty hefty um, amount of stuff. And what's crazy is I'm looking at like the pie chart of my macros: fat, carbs, and, and, and proteins. And it's 45% of it was carbs, 41% of it was fats, and 14% of it was protein. And that's crazy to me. Like that, it just shows you like when you don't eat right like the crap you put in your system like if you eat fast food every day like this or just just fast food fast food in general you're getting so many fat and carbs thrown in your system without the protein that you need it's just so bad for you like i i can look back and remember when i actually ate like this um because i would eat a full pizza in a sitting with a full two liter mountain dew like no problem and have like that McDon like a mcdonald's meal or that that checkers meal i had today i would have that on normal occasion and uh, looking back, I said, well, no wonder I was a big dude, because I was just putting all that crap in my system. Um, it's so important to eat healthy. So important. I'm so glad that a year ago I started eating healthy, because I feel so much better. Like, right now, I feel like crap. You feel like crap, too, right? Yeah? Oh, she's been she's been eating. She hasn't ate as much as I have today, but she she took the time to uh, eat a little bit crappier today, too. Um, yeah, she thinks it's the ice cream, too. I'm telling you, it's the dairy. The dairy is what did it. The dairy is, you don't eat a lot of dairy. Like I don't eat. I, like I said, I drink almond milk. Um, I barely eat any cheese anymore. If I do eat cheese, it's like reduced fat. It's like I just don't eat a lot of dairy. And to pile in, I've eaten. I drank a lot of dairy or eaten a lot of dairy today. 
So it's it's yeah, it's definitely uh, hurting me. But anyways, so yeah, so there you go, almost 9,000 calories. Um, I hope that you know you see that a you can have cheat days because I'm not worried about it. Tomorrow I start the two, uh, the three day refresh. Um, if you want to see the video about the three day refresh, just click here. I'll put a little annotation to the three day refresh video here. Um, if you want to see what that's all about, uh, you can check that out. I'm gonna do that, flush all the toxins out, and be ready to go on Monday for another round of P90X3. Uh, the mass calendar is gonna bulk back up. Um, I'm gonna weigh in tomorrow. I weighed 170. One, I think the other day or yesterday whenever we weighed ourselves um, so yeah so I would assume that I gained a little bit today probably not a lot because like I the funny thing about this is, is when you eat healthy then you eat like this you burn it off pretty quickly I was sweating so bad today while I was eating because my body was like crazily trying to burn this junk off off me anyways so yeah so that's how my day went um, I'll be back in a few days for uh, you know to give you an update of what's going on but Thanks for uh, checking out this video about me eating like a maniac, and uh, yeah, hope it uh, teaches you something and shows you that you can't eat like this every day, because if you do, you're going to be a big fatty. Alright, anyways, uh, <coughs> see you guys later, uh, eat healthy, and work out, and have a good, have a good day. See you guys.